of the high school football season gave us two whole nights of district action. We start on Thursday. Scotty McCoy and the McGoffin County Hornets hit the road to Jackson to take on district rival Breathitt County. Big play after big play from both quarterbacks, McGoffin's Dalton Keaton and Breathitt's John Fletcher Collins. But in the end, it took two overtimes to decide a winner in the Hornets left the field celebrating in a 57 to 49 win. To Friday, our game of the week took us to Daniel Field where two one-loss teams battled it out on the gridiron, Prestonsburg and Hazard. The weather kept the ball on the ground for the Black Cats, but it didn't matter. Five touchdowns all rushing in the Peaberg victory over the Bulldogs. Big night for Class 5A District 7, South Laurel and Lincoln County going on in London, just down the road, North Laurel and Pulaski County, and out in Somerset, Southwestern and Madison Southern. South Laurel jumped out to a quick 14-0 lead over the Patriots, but Lincoln came back to win it. How about North Laurel holding the Maroons to their lowest points total all season? But doesn't matter. Number one Pulaski County comes away with the win 14-12. And Madison Southern sees their first loss on the season to the Southwestern Warriors on the road. Going around the coverage area now, how about the Jenkins Cavaliers getting their first win on the season over Knott Central and first win of the Daniel Sexton era in the green and white. Check out the Leslie County Eagles improving to 6-0 with a win on the road to Jackson County. They'll be put to the test the next three weeks as they take on the tough 2A District 8. The Knox Central Panthers were without key wideout Matthew Barger, but doesn't matter. They roll over district opponent Clay County 42-8. District play continues into next week, of course, but for now, this has been your Lee's Famous Recipe Hazard and Whitesburg 2-Minute Drill.